This is Preet Ganatra and welcome to the second episode of Wedding Looks with Pink Villa. So once again today we have Janvi with us. We will be creating a sangeet slash cocktail look inspired by the Bollywood celebrity Kriti Senon. So in this look, we can see a very flawless and a subtle foundation with a lot of focus on the eyes. Our step number one is the most cardinal part of the makeup, which is the skin preparation. As we know, Janvi has a normal to dry skin, which is why I will be using a cream based primer on her face. Now that the skin is well hydrated and supple, I will move on to the next step, which is adding a little tinge of glow, basically the forehead, the nose, the lips, chin, and the high points of the cheek. Once my skin is ready to take the makeup, I will move on to my second step, which is the correction and the concealing. As we can see, Janvi has a very clear skin with a little pigmentation on the under eye and around the lips. So I will restrict my concealer and corrector right to these pigmented areas. I will move on to the next step. Now this is a little different for a sangeet or a cocktail since these functions are placed in the evening. We tend to be in artificial lights. Here we need a little more shape and sculpt on the face as compared to something that we do during the day. For the sculpting, I will be using a cream contour stick directly on the outer corners of her face. The placement of this product has to be right underneath the cheekbone in order to define the jawline and the cheekbone. While blending the contour from near the cheeks, we will be pushing the product back towards the hairline. And from the front, we will be pushing it in an upward direction. Now, if you carefully observe, you will notice that the right side of the face where I have already blended my contour looks a little lifted and thinner as compared to the left side of the face, which looks a lot more bulgier. The concealer is basically looking very bright. The contour is looking very shaded. So next, in order to even out the entire face, just like the flawless look that we saw on Kriti, we will be using a foundation. This time with the foundation, I will be mixing a little of my cream highlighter, which is the strobe cream. Make sure you cover the neck because you don't want the difference in the skin tone to be very evident. While blending the foundation, just make sure that you blend the contour with the foundation pretty well so that the entire face looks like a seamless blend with a generous amount of loose powder just to set the base. The contour and the highlight together will create like a bronzed effect on the face. Now for the eyebrows, I will be using a small angular brush in order to give a very defined and a crisp shape to the eyebrows. I am using a gel product. Moving on to our eye makeup, this one has a pop of color, but we will be using the color smoky technique here. For that, I'm using a fluffy brush and taking a cream black eyeshadow. So basically, when Janvi opens her eye, we should not be able to see any black color on top of her eye. Before you apply the color onto the eye, it's very important to get rid of the excess color onto a tissue paper or a cloth to prevent it from falling out under the eye. Just gently rub the product onto the cream black eyeshadow. The black cream beneath the color will basically just help to enhance and uplift the intensity of the color. Next, I will be using a big fluffy brush in order to even out the shape above the crease. Next, I'm using a flat brush to deposit the highlighter right underneath the arc of the eyebrow on the brow bone. Just to finish off the eye makeup, I will be repeating the same steps of the cream black eyeshadow and the shimmer on the under eye without a cold pencil, just so that it looks very even and complete. 
So with that, my eyeshadow is done. I will just finish it off with some mascara. And for this one, I will be adding a set of falsies just to add that little extra glam and drama. The eyelashes have brought together the entire look and added the extra glam. So for the lips, I will be going with a very nude pink color. Something that just proportionates the entire face. Next, I will be cutting down the excess cream with my finger. And finally, to make the lipstick last long, I will be adding a pop of powder highlighter onto the lips. To finish off, I will be using my big powder brush in order to clean the face and remove any kind of pigmentation or fallouts. So with that, we have come to an end of this extra glamorous and beautiful cocktail slash Sangeet look inspired by Kriti Sanon. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, do let me know in the comments section and also don't forget to like and subscribe to Pink Villa.